the community of Grangeville, Idaho in mourning. Idaho State Police say three teens were in a truck just south of Grangeville when the driver lost control and hit a tree. All three died in the accident. KXY4's Aaron Luna has more now from Grangeville. You can see the tire tracks that crossed the road where the truck went off the edge and hit this tree right here where it burst into flames. Members of the community say the accident that took three Grangeville teens has been a shock to everyone. Bright flowers and pictures mark the spot where three Grangeville teens lost their lives. A spot Justin Lindsley has visited 10 times since Saturday. I feel obligated to go up there and say, hey man, how's it going? Sure miss you. Justin's best friend, Justin Dempsey, died in the crash along with James McCall and Leela Lehman. I still call his phone just to, I still don't believe it. And neither can the tight knit community of just over 3,000. Bad stuff happens in our world. It, it does happen, and I don't know that we have the answer to why. But what we do have the answer to is you don't have to go through it alone. Local churches organized a vigil over the weekend to help console friends and family. Young kids that just had the world in front of them, you know, their lives in front of them. Heartbreak for their families. Layman loved Supercross and rode as often as possible. Dempsey's friends described him as a ball of fun. All three will be missed. No matter what it was, he always put others before himself. McCulloch was driving the truck when it crashed and there is speculation on what caused the accident. But one thing is for sure. It's the death of dreams. It's the death of plans. It's I think that's really hard for all of us to take. Now along with emerging emotions, shock, disbelief, grief, sadness. Grangeville will hold three funerals in one week and best friends will have to say goodbye. I miss them a lot. At this time, the cause of the accident is still under investigation. Reporting in Grangeville, Aaron Luna, KXOY4 News.